it looks like our rent's going to 500. Is that right? Yes, probably that's probably due to us receiving yeah. an increase from the rent from right. the landlord. We will not yeah. raise yours any more than what we get in terms of the rent. And again, the system's probably going to have to be adjusted. I've got $34,000 in contingencies, so we have room to adjust. Uh, mileage, I just kind of went up. I don't know if they're going to raise the federal rate, but I don't anticipate they might. I just kind of put a little bit more in there just to see. And then, again, conferences, I, I, I increased too because if we're able to, you know, just more of that traveling would be nice. But just, you know, all of this is kind of fluid because I'm not sure that we'll spend all this, but I've got it budgeted anyway, and our budgets do. So I just kind of wanted approval on that. Any uh, questions for Diane on the budget? I, I ran a criteria. She thought it looks okay. And we, that's kind of the number we decided, 90000 Is that what we have done, right? So, and most of that's because of salary that we didn't spend because yeah. Allison was not around. And again, um, not because Allison wasn't here, we didn't the mark anything to get done and things. So I think that, I don't think we'll spend all this, but we have it in size. And, you have a cushion. I have a cushion, and I'm gonna believe me, I'm gonna manage it well. But I think it kind of have a little more marketing. Okay, if there's uh, no questions for Diane, does somebody want to make a motion on this budget? Maybe that's a typo. I move that we adopt the budget. Okay, there's been a motion made by Jerry that we adopt the budget as presented. Is there a second? I'll second it. Uh, any uh, further discussion? Clarification. Sure. The draft budget has an expenditure of 270, 749. Yeah. And the previous, what we're showing. The previous year was showing. It was 180,000. So we had a carryover. We got a carryover. I understand that. But do we want, are we planning to spend all of that carryover? No, no. We don't want to. Well, you showed a contingency of 30, almost $35,000. Just so you And you'll be putting up 60, 60, 60 right. again. I think that's what we that's decided what we talked on before. About so it's $180,000 plus, plus, plus the carryover. Right. Yeah, that was, that was what everyone discussed last meeting was to go ahead and fully fund the carryover. That was that expenditure. And then if you, but if something happens with you don't have any carryover, so the next year, then you will decrease that budget back down to the sure. $180,000. Sure. Sure. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
you that. Oh, I don't know why you need another plug, but I'm just saying Imperial County is just, I mean, it's really a hotbed for all types of business. In our case, we're pre pretty much going after energy businesses for our construction engineering services. But, I mean, it's just so incredible that all this stuff is happening right now. We're just so happy to be here. I mean, I'm happy to be here, but we're happy to uh, be involved in what has been going on before and what's going on in the future. So. We're happy to have you. Yeah, if thanks. you have any enterprise zone questions, please get a hold of me. I absolutely will. I'd like will. to offer something like eight with you and answer anything that I can. Yeah, okay, sure. Any of your clients that want to talk to them about it, just let me know. We'll be there for them. Do what we can that. do. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate okay. that. Thanks a lot. Thanks and I'll provide you. Yeah, awesome. and Sugi has been, been great. Did, did you already have contact with Hell Energy before the Yes, we did, actually. We've done some work with them. I think the most recent was 2003, 2004. We did some major pumping expansion. I haven't haven't talked with them recently. They were doing some insulation on some of their super duplex pipes and things. And uh, Brian Harms, who actually used to be over with Hell Energy, is now in the format. Trying to, you know, they have a lot going on over there, too. And then, uh, Cal, um, California ethanol power and the summit. Oh, really exciting. Yeah, I mean, we've, I've been sure. talking to Pacific ethanol as well prior to the, the summit as well. <coughs> now I'm talking more about it. Yeah, yeah I know. I, I definitely, I got two of her cards. <laughs> yeah. I don't lose one. Yeah. So. But again, I'm just really happy to be here. I just want to continue to be involved with it. Well, anyway, I can assist you. And We're very excited about, about, the, about yeah. the renewables resource. Yeah, me too. And also, I know there's a lot of wind opportunities. I just wanted to bring up that the city's already higher than the city manager. And Diane, you might want to make it on the front. I will. Okay. Who is the name? His name is Gary Burroughs, B U R R O U G H S. And I believe it's starting Monday. Okay. He's going to have a council. Do you have anything on the phone?